Hey YouTube, this is Rest Music Park Fan 62. This is part two of my uh, tour of Dollywood for a Smoky Mountain Christmas. So, this is the end of uh, the Dolly Parton experience. Um, so, here we get into the 50 section. So, in this, you're going to see Lightning Rod. Um, and that uh, I am going to do something a little bit different and you'll see but in this so you're you're going to see what it was like from the 1950s um, one thing I like about this is these lights um, and then so we have Red's Diner with these lights of lighted trees um and then one of the first lighted trees that we can see um so here's a look at some more um i will do a tour of that as well in this video <laughs> so um So we're coming around to Lightning Rod. So here's Red's Diner. Um, the thing I will miss is the tree on top right there they used to do. So. So, um, um, I will do a day version as well. That will probably be tomorrow on Saturday. So, um, we are about to leave the 50 section here in a minute. Um, so then we have that tree up there. Um, I will say this, the thing I do miss is how they lighted the bridge up. Uh, cause they used to have like, they look like C9 lights, but they were, or C7 lights, but they were LEDs. So, this is also new for this year, these trees. I don't know if they dance the music and stuff. Or how that's working. But that looks pretty cool. Um, so, then... We are getting more into the matter. So, um, so beside me is the Smoky Mountain River Rampage, as well as the other part of that uh, creek. Um, So, that bright light ahead of you is part of the river rampage. So, here's one of the um, um, uh, trees as well. I, I like the fact it's gold. So, it's a color that you really, really don't see a lot of. Um as well as like the sparkler looking contraptions. Um, so, and this area is just an eating area for uh, dogs and taters as well as the 
seasonal food stand. So around here is going to be going up toward the county fair as well as pictures with Santa as well. So, oh, something's going on there. I don't know if it should be doing that or not. So, um, there's lights under there just for some reason they're not turned on or someone hasn't flipped the switch yet. So, now we are going to go up toward um, the county fair. So, I'm going to be just something a little bit different. Um, so, when I come back down, I am going to head toward the front and go up that way. So, here is another tree with green lights. So, um, in here is the county fair, as well as, um, uh, pictures with Santa and stuff like that. So, one of the things I like they're doing is they're using more traditional Christmas colors, such as reds and greens and some whites to mix in and then i love these trees i've seen these for the past couple of years now um these are all up and down um so this is lumberjack's pizza um I love the LED green that they are using. So the specialty food they have here is a loaded potato soup, as well as a rosemary garlic white pizza. Um, that'd be another video to come too. So here is the train depot. One of the few times does not actually have a long line Today's lines haven't been that bad because of rain or chance of rain throughout the day. So, um, so here's the traditional carousel with the reds and the whites and the greens. So, this building is where you get your pictures with Santa. And then that building across from it with the red and white is where you get them developed. So now we're gonna go into the county fair. So, um, um, So, in the county fair, they have a lot of the icicle lights that um, I said I've liked in the past. Um, and they also have that uh, celebration or buffet everybody likes as well so this building right here is their i assume like their event area or catering area or something like that so the windows look very nice um here is all of the icicle lights i love this tree 
Um, so it looks very icy looking. There's more of those trees I was talking about. So, so this is the entrance into the special events area. So it's decorated nicely. So this is the bridge. So here is the celebration hall. So this is where they've been having the buffets they've had for, I think it was the summer, Christmas. They didn't, so they don't have one around um, Halloween. So, there's more red and white lights. So, um, here, so here's more of those icicle lights along with uh, white and red lights. So, as you can see, it's like candy cane themed in this area a lot. Um, so, and it's looking really well, especially now with the sun that went, that came out for a bit, went down. So, What does this mean for the rest of the park? Well, you'll see. Down there is more of the red and white lights along with those trees. So. So now we are Heading back. So, um, like I said, today is opening day. Uh, the reason why today is not as crowded has been there's been rain off and on all day. <sighs> not so, not so much like a pouring rain, but it's been like a mist. So, I think that's what's kept a lot of people away. Um, so, now we're heading back up. We're going to head around as well. I love how they kind of transition this. I do kind of wish they would put lights back here though, but that's just me being picky. So, so this arena that you see up here with the green and white lights along with the trees it's where the mistletones play that i did in my what you need to know video um so and there's the pictures with santa at the hot song theater and there's the photos 
Um, I'm gonna, there's gonna be a part three that's gonna show the rest.